Go. Hello, this is Rich English, and today we're going to be talking about the redaction or electronic whiteout feature that is found on sharp color copiers. So for today's sample, we're going to take a hard copy original, that is a brochure, and we're going to change it from a 2610, 3110, and 3610 brochure to simply a 2610 brochure. Here's how we do it. We take our original, we place it face up into the document feeder, we go to the control panel, we press the preview button. Now, the whiteout can be used not only for copies, but it can also be used for faxes and for scans as well. Now, once we've got this set up, we want to hit the edit button. We want to go here to call it this menu, and we want to erase a specified range on the copier. So all we have to do now is let's get in nice and close so we can see what we're trying to erase. And I'll just drag, 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 and there it is. That's the area I want to erase. So I want to erase, first of all, the 3610. That's going to be my start point. And my Y axis is going to be down there. That's my end point. And I take a look, and that's pretty good. But well, wait a minute, I forgot. I also want to erase the, the 3110. So I tap on this, and I can simply move it up to there. Now that looks pretty good. Now if I wanted to, I could erase up to three more areas per page. But let's say I just want to do this one. I hit execute. Now the area turned to red as you saw. And now what I'll do is I'll hit exit. I'll hit edit end. And now I have a choice between copying that in either black or white or color. I'm going to print this in color. And what you'll wind up with is a color copy that looks exactly like this with only the 2610 brochure showing for a 2610 brochure. Thank you very much.